What's up, Top Shoppers? It's Jennifer. Welcome back to another YouTube video. Uh, huge shout out to all 4.41K of you for subscribing. Thank you so much for being here. Today, we're gonna uh, talk about what could potentially get you banned on NBA Top Shots, which I would not wish upon my worst enemy. Okay, so after I read through the terms of service, I literally found this blog article that uh, Top Shot put out uh, titled NBA Top Shot Code of Conduct, and it pretty much summarizes the terms of service um, it makes it easier to read through. So we're gonna mostly be referencing this, but I might also bring in little clips from the actual terms of service as well. Okay, so first of all, it says they do not encourage off-market transactions. Um, actually, the uh, Top Shot moderators in the Discord used to actually like be like the middlemen for um, trades back in the day, but then they didn't wanna be held liable, so they stopped doing that. Um, so if you are doing any off-market transactions, do it at your own risk. Topshot doesn't want to be held liable for that, so they do not encourage it. And as, as they say here, we strongly urge collectors to transact inside of the marketplace for safety and simplicity. Okay, next up, bot usage is strictly prohibited on NBA Topshot. So if you use bots to game the system, you know, for pack drops or on the marketplace to get an unfair advantage, um, your account could be suspended or canceled. Also, if you bought moments from people who used bots to get the moments or the packs, um, then same thing, your, your account could get suspended or canceled as well. Okay, so if you have multiple accounts, that is no longer allowed. It actually, you actually used to have multiple, used to be able to have multiple accounts and it wasn't against the rules, but now it is strictly prohibited. You're not allowed to have multiple accounts. It's one account per person and that's it. Okay, next it says the selling of Dapper credits is strictly prohibited. So buying or selling Dapper credit could lead to account suspension. And an example of this is, for example, if, if, an, if a moment is worth $5, like let's say it's a, a 35,000 CC as too common and it's going for like five bucks and it sells for like $10,000 and it's not even like a good cereal, then you know most likely that person is transferring dapper credit and, and that's an example of um, buying and selling dapper credit and that can get you in trouble all right next it says selling an account that won a random draw for a pack is against our terms of use please refrain from doing so and finally you have to be 18 or older to have an nba top shot account so minors are not allowed uh to own an account on nba top shot it actually used to be where you can um you can actually have an account with your parents' permission if you were under 18, but I guess they changed the terms of service and you're not allowed to have an account if you're a minor. All right, now that we're done going over the blog article, um, here are a few things that I read from the terms of service that I thought were interesting that I wanted to share with you. Okay, so if you use a VPN um, to, to access your account, like, like let's say you know, you're not allowed to have an account because you live in a certain country, if you then spoof your location through a VPN, your account could be um, frozen or terminated. All right, so transactions are not reversible. So if you accidentally sell something for $5 instead of 500, sorry. All right, so you can actually request to have your account and your personal data deleted if you email dpo at mbatopshot.com. And finally, if Dapper suspends or terminates your account, they don't have to tell you why. All right, thank you all so much for watching. If you've gotten this far in the video, please like it. Uh, help me push this out to more people and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.